Uh, we're coming in. Chief Dr. Rotarian Jackie Aduni Kazim. I'm of the MISA Group, Nigeria International Limited. Well, Nipa, I want to talk because I share Kosi. I share. I share what? She went into my graduates, Tony Masters. I share Woloni. I share Pori Shirishi. Momo, I want graduates to help me. They work with me in the factory. And from there, it was a stepping stone for them. But how many youths of nowadays are ready to start from the grassroots? It's not that there's no job, but there's not enough job for people. I tell them, if you don't start from the scratch, you will not have a complete history. You can have all the degree in the world. There's time for everything. And when you start from the scratch, you know what you went through. <clears throat> to get to wherever you are. A lot of our politicians, our so-called prominent people nowadays, when they want to tell their history, they start selling it from where they start making it. They don't tell it from where they started from. And uh, I'm hoping and I'm praying that sooner or later Nigeria is going to change. We have to create that job ourselves. The youth have to look inward and say, look, how am I going to start? How can I start with? It's not when you have billions or you have millions you can set up. Nowadays, I have a guy who is into this uh, networking and he's doing very well now. What he does, he brings people around and teach them. You can make money yourself. You don't have to rely on the government, which a lot of us do. All of us want a white collar job. There is no white collar job anymore in Nigeria. Don't let's deceive ourselves. Unless you're a minister's sister, or you're a minister brother, or your mother is giving you a note to go and meet so 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 and so 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 person, but we don't need that anymore. We can set up things ourselves and pick it up from there. And once you know you have started rising up, you encourage others. You bring them in. Gather yourself together. Form a company yourself, and sell yourself to the people out there. Because the world needs Africans. Our boys are very intelligent, they're very smart, and we're, we're being needed everywhere now. But the thing is, a lot of people are afraid of those bad eggs that have entered the good eggs. But I say, Nigeria, we're hoping and we're praying that sooner or later, we cannot go on like this. Nigeria is going to change. And I'm praying for the youth, for them to know their right from their wrong, they must have a focus. And I pray to God Almighty Father that he will lead the youth this time around and they will not be used by politicians. 